This is the reminder move for ATM lesson number two, seeing the heels. Please lie on your back and gently scan yourself. Your arms and legs are at your side. Notice any spaces in which you lift up away from the floor and where you're pressed down into the floor. And after you have a good idea of the contact that you maintain with the ground, very gently roll over onto your stomach. Now would you please bring your arms up so your left arm is bent and your right arm is bent with your right face cheek on the back of your left hand. So this means that the palm of your left hand is on the back of your right hand. Now would you very gently begin to lift your left elbow and your head up towards the ceiling and slowly, slowly return it towards the floor. Over and over again, easy. Lift your left elbow, your hand, and your head up off of the ground and slowly let it come down. Now there's two ways that you can do this. You can actually use the muscles of the back of your neck and your head to assist in lifting your head. Or you can do your best to allow your head to be dead weight and use your hand to assist to lift your head up off of the floor. It's much more difficult and you move a lot less. But try both just to see how it feels. Now would you change your hands over and turn your head in the opposite direction. So this means that your right hand is on top of your left and your right ear is on the back of your right hand. And begin to gently lift your head, your hand, and your elbow up off of the ground. Just over and over again, easy, very gently, very softly, very simply, lift and lower. Now would you change your hands over again and very gently bend both of your knees so your feet are up towards the ceiling. So now your face is turned towards the right, your left ear is on the back of your left hand. And would you very gently lift your left elbow, your hand, and your head up off of the ground and with your eyes, out of the corner of your eye sockets, look over your right shoulder as if you're going to try and catch a glimpse of your right heel. And then come down and rest. So to do this, as you lift, look over your right shoulder, you've got to somewhat bend at the waist very gently. And then come down. and then change over your hands. Keep your knees bent up towards the ceiling. Your face is turned towards the left. Your right ear is on the back of your right hand and your right palm is on top of your left hand. And very gently lift your hand, your head, and your elbow and look over your left shoulder as if you can catch a glimpse of your left heel out of the corner of your eyes and then come down and rest. So lift, bend at your waist, at your trunk, in your ribs, soften your chest, look over your left, and then come back down.
and then leave this alone and let yourself rest. Now go back to the same position so your face is turned towards the left, your right ear is on the back of your right shoulder. Your knees are bent with your feet up towards the ceiling. And very gently begin to lift your hand, your elbow, and your head. And then come down and rest. So we're repeating the same movement as before. But now what we'll do is you lift your head and look over your left shoulder. Can you lift your left leg just slightly up off of the ground? And notice what happens in your back, in your pelvis. And then slowly let that come down. And after a few times, change your hands over. Turn your head over towards the right. Have your left ear on the back of your right hand. And very gently begin to lift your elbow, your hand, and your head, looking over your right shoulder as you lift your right leg up towards the ceiling. And then let that come down and rest. And then leave this alone, let your legs go long, and roll over onto your back. And scan yourself to see if there's any differences than before, just this tiny little bit, these simple movements. What type of impact, what type of small impact, or maybe large impact, has it made on your connection with the ground? And have you been able to change and reorganize your system to allow a better contact with the floor? and see how this carries over in your day-to-day -day movements. So enjoy, leave me a comment down below, and I look forward to hearing how this works for you. Take care of yourself and have a great day.